boring but necessary. Okay, so I will turn the volume back down. Okay, so basically this is a, uh, I think these are power chords actually, so I think it's like a power chord progression, and uh, so the first tackle was at, uh, at least learning how to... Learning how to position my fingers to strum it right, that was the first thing, and then I had to learn... to learn to go one, two, three, four uh, with, I think I just did that at a reasonable speed, or it's uh, the speed I used was actually, I think, faster than the song, or at least faster than the song starts. But it's a very rhythmic thing, and it's like, um, learning how to play the song, I can tell that, like, um, the way the rhythm, like, it doesn't stay at a consistent pace. It speeds up and slows down and, like, you know. So, and I think the only way, way that was achieved, and it was achieved by someone who was like 22 or 23, uh, uh, yeah, but, you know, guitarists can start at 12, so blah, 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 blah. I don't know what I'm talking about. Anyways. Uh, so the, the other way this weird, I don't know how I'm going to learn it because like you basically have to play it over and over and over again and I can picture the person who wrote the song um, basically just playing those chords over and over and over for like, Melissa says I should practice six hours a day but I'm pretty sure six hours a day of practice would be good for me. So I, I can just picture someone uh, playing those four chords like over and over again for hours at least, like hours at least per day. And um, when something solidifies, like when the, when the, like if the core knowledge of the, the song is if that's the core knowledge of the song, um, the extended or like refined knowledge is doing what I just did, like basically 2,000 times, at least 2,000 times um, over the course of, I don't know how, how long they were doing it for, but um, and I think this is true, like, um, I'll move on to lithium, the lithium power chords. So that's the, that's the basic. I, I know the power chords, I know the shape of the power chords, how to attain the shape. Uh, I'm still at the point where I'm touching neighboring notes, neighboring strings a little bit, which is bad. But basically with that you just have to do it over and over and over again. And it's like, you have to be, you basically have to be in love with uh, the sound you're making. And as you just do it like it's, 
I mean, it's hard not to compare it to drugs. Like, it's like as you take each hit of like um, doing the right chord progression or the right chord, um, and I assume the people who wrote these songs have been playing for years, and they all they know all about the fundamentals of guitar. So I I am not at that level yet. But if you're composing a song, you basically you get like, so you get, you say, this, this progression sounds good to me. And then you just play with that progression for what has to be months. And uh, as you play with the progression, there are slight variations in like tempo and ah fuck yes I just remembered a musical term tempo and speed whatever um, it's just yeah I, I I think I've expressed myself I think I think you can understand what I'm saying um, so let's do some more lithium. This way sounds a bit more like the actual song. So that's me like imitating someone else's work, and that's me trying to get to the part where they were. Um, when they finished the song, assuming I'm going to try to learn this like all the way through, uh, so try try to get to their point. But I think if you're like a musician who's been playing for five years, you'll learn a song and you'll start learning the song, and you'll be like, and then you'll find it. I don't know what. Let's just say, just. You, I, for me, everything resolves in E minor. So, anyways, you, 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 uh, you, you've been doing this progression for so long that you're like, you know what? I, I like this song, but I think it would be better if it was done this way. Anyways, all of this you already know if you're watching this video, I just realized. But it's new to me, so I'm speaking it, and speaking it helps solidify it in my brain. It's amazing my brain is so, um, I don't know, you might say I'm saying stupid things, but I feel pretty capable considering it's 2.35 a.m., at least like the speed of my voice and whatever.
was able to you know, do that. Um, so. of the brain that, uh, like the long-term memory compared to frontal lobe stuff, blah, 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 uh, I don't think anyone's interested in that. Um, so now we move on to caged. And we do the root notes. <laughs> telling you a story that's completely unrelated uh, to what I'm doing here. I have a story in my head, but I'm not going to tell it.
usually that particular, this is a diff difficult shape in general, but usually that one is a, a tricky one. That shape appears somewhere else. Well, I mean, I guess that goes down to 15, so... Um, yeah, I don't know. It'll pop up again, don't worry. CK has this uh, routine he goes through in interviews. It's not like a stand-up routine. It's just like he does so many interviews, he repeats uh, what he says. I shouldn't be picking the nose, I know. Uh, anyways, um, he says that when he was starting production on his TV show, uh, a kid walked by and gave a middle finger to the camera. And he says that's what he knew it was going to be good because people were um, trying to stop him or like discourage him, whatever. I'm paraphrasing what he's saying, but it's inspiring, or inspiring words. Like <laughs> it's inspiring to me. I don't know. And, and I don't want to be very sick. Okay, don't worry. Smoking. I'm gonna wish I started exercising earlier. But I was in gym throughout high school, and I took swimming and stuff. And so, like, I'm not that much of a waste, or like, whatever you want to call it. No judgment for like, if you are out of shape, because. You know, I, I can't, I can't really say anything. I, I can't really insult you based on who I am. Um, and this is the weird chord that doesn't sound right. Thank you. 
consciously look for it, but I want to see it just appear to me, but like a recurring pattern and have the root notes uh, manifest themselves. I'm interested in finding that out. 